I see you girls remembered St. Patrick's Day. Please, no pinching, right? <laughs> oh, you've got your green on too. I didn't wear green today, but that's okay. Um, guys, today is the second Sunday of Lent. And last week, I was speaking with our pastor on Monday night, and I told him that it was about imitation, and he said, yes as a reflection, and that has stuck with me all week, so I have something I want y'all to look at. <clears throat> Can you get it out? Anybody ever use these? Who do you see? Who do you see? What? Who do you see? Myself. Who do you see? No one? <laughs> Who do you see? Who do you see? And when I look, I see myself as well. But do you know who God wants us to see? He wants us to see our reflection as his son Jesus, okay? Um, the reflection of Jesus is how we're supposed to imitate him. You know, when babies are little, they imitate what we do. Anybody been around a baby? Watch them blow bubbles, watch them wave. That's how they learn. That's how each one of you learned. That's how I learned when I was a kid. When I first started teaching, we used mirrors in the classroom to teach children how to position their mouths to say sounds correctly. And we used the mirror to do that. So how do you think that we can reflect Jesus in our daily lives? What are some things we could do? Any ideas? better people to each other be better people to each other do you know what jesus command to us before he left this world as he died on the cross and rose again was love each other as i've loved you what did he do for us he died for us didn't he he was sinless he came to this world blameless sinless and then he died for our sins and when he rose we are allowed to have everlasting life if we believe in him, right? We ask him into our hearts. In John 14, 34, that's where that commandment is. It says, and so I am giving a new commandment to you now. Love each other just as much as I love you. Your strong love for each other will prove to the world that you are my disciples. And how do people know that we love Jesus? by our doings, what we are, what we, how we act towards people, right? John 15, 9 <clears throat> also says, I have loved you even as the Father has loved me. Live within my love. And that scripture caught my heart so much. How do we live within his love? We love everybody. Not just your friends, not just your parents, not your gra just your grandparents. We love even those people that are not very nice to us, right? Yeah. There was a bracelet a long time ago. It was popular, WWJD. And everybody had those. And that stood for what would Jesus do? So as you go this week through school, I want you to think about the things that Jesus would do. What would he do in the situations that you're faced with? And pray for your enemies. Pray for those who aren't kind to you. And help them to see the reflection of Jesus in you. Let's have a prayer, okay? Father, thank you for each one of these boys and girls. And for the fact that you gave your son for us. That we could have eternal life. Help us as we go this week to be a reflection of Jesus in our lives. In your name we pray. Amen. Guys, I have a